Hey loves, now I had promised to teach you guys how to make a sales book and um, that's what I'm here to do today. And before I actually teach you guys how to do that, I would like to like explain a little bit because um, it is not good to assume that each and every person knows what a sales book is, all right? Now, if you are in business, you need to be able to track your sales. You need to know how much you make. You need to know whether you're operating on a profit or on a loss. And the only way you're gonna be able to do that is you can make your own sales book, all right? Now, there are actually options of buying a sales book, but if you do not have, um, the finances to afford a sales book you can always make one for yourself because it's something very simple and it's going to help you to be able to track what exactly you're doing all right because it's always good to be able to track how much you need um know whether you're operating on a profit or a loss so basically a sales book is a kind of book that is going to be able to help you track track that all right now i do not have a, rule, a ruler with me here so i'm just going to be showing you guys a simple um thing um hoping that you guys follow okay so now the first thing that you're gonna do take you can buy a book this just the kawaii books like the costs at only is about 15 bob done for 32 pages all right so you're gonna make columns okay i don't have a ruler so i'm just gonna do it roughly um so that you guys can understand okay so you're gonna make columns first you're gonna draw um a straight line I literally should you guys how to draw a line and then you're gonna make columns now the number of columns that you are gonna make is six columns okay make six columns okay so let me do that off camera because um yeah so three four one two three four five six okay so like that okay you're gonna make six columns like that one two three four five six very simple all right now on the first column on top you're gonna write the date okay so you write the date okay now on the second column you're gonna write name okay write name on the third column, write item. Right? Item. Item. On the fourth column, write quantity. Okay? On the fifth column, write the price. Alright? And on the last column, write your total. Okay? So it's going to look something like this. Um, I hope it's gonna focus perfect. It's gonna look like this your name over here. I uh, sorry your date your name your item Quantity your price and your total it is as simple as that So literally just buy a book where you can be buying you can be noting this down and that's literally your sales book I would have showed you guys mine but Wadaku Watani Sorora <laughs> So yeah, um so literally it's that simple and you have your sales book so buy a book and you can you you're gonna be able to at least monitor what you make and learn whether you're operating on a profit or a loss, all right. So on the first um place you're gonna mark out the date um like today. When is the date today? Twenty fourth, all right, twenty fourth of February name we can put the pukulu because why not all right the pukulu all right the item that they took is a t-shirt okay quantity they took two t-shirts the price is kenya shillings 150 each total is 300 okay so that is how you're going to write it okay the date and then the name of the pukulu what he took how many of them they took the price and the total okay now an added thing you see this 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 last column over here when you finish writing this over here at the end you can be writing either paid or not paid okay so here paid or not paid okay so just like that monitor 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 and there you have your sales book very simple because one thing i always believe the moment you do not um track your sales then you're not gonna be um 
you're not going to know your business you're not going to know whether you're operating on a profit or on a loss so it's very important that you keep your books right it's very important that you are able to account um for everything because that sales book is gonna help you a lot when you're in business okay yeah that's just what i had to share for today's video thank you for watching um subscribe to the channel if you haven't already um give this video a thumbs up i'll appreciate it. if you have any question write it down on the comment section i will most definitely respond and if it needs a video i'm gonna do it for you okay so i'll see you guys on the next video which is hopefully gonna be soon and if there's something that you have not understood but i believe that is very simple very very simple but just in case there is something that you have not understood please write it down on the comment section and i will most most definitely um respond to it or respond to you and if you need clarification i'm gonna do it with a video sasa so, so, i'll see you guys on my next bye bye